Hi there. Now, for this question, we're asked to show that this integral, that is x to the power 3 over 2 minus 1, integrated with respect to x between the limits x equals 1, x equals 4, comes to 9 and 2 fifths. So to do this, in the usual way, for something like this, just add 1 to the power and divide by the new power. So you're going to have x to the power 5 over 2, if we add 1 to the 3 over 2. Dividing by 5 over 2 just means that you can put the 5 there and then the 2 up there. When we come to integrate the constant minus 1, you're going to get minus 1x, or just simply minus x. And then put this between the limits, and those limits are x equals 1 to x equals 4. We now substitute x equals 4 into here, and then we subtract what we get when we put x equals to 1. So first of all then, when we put x equals 4, we're going to have 2 fifths multiplied by 4 to the power 5 over 2. And then you're going to have minus, when x is 4 there, just put 4 in. And then from this, we subtract what we get when we put 1 through. So you're going to have 2 fifths times 1 to the power 5 over 2 minus the 1. OK, so working this out, 4 to the power 5 over 2, take the square root of 4, which is 2. 2 to the power 5 is 32. 32 times the 2 is 64. So you've got 64 over 5 there. 64 fifths minus the 4. And then from this we subtract, well, 1 to the power 5 over 2 is still going to be 1. Square root of 1 is 1. 1 to the power 5 is 1. So you've got 2 fifths there minus the 1. And when you work this out, very easy, you'll see that it comes to 9 and 2 fifths. Okay.